Welcome everyone. We're so happy that you're joining us today. I'm very excited to introduce our special guest, Deng Mingdao, author, artist, and teacher of Chinese martial arts and Taoist wellness techniques. So the word Dao is a picture of a head. So the two points on top are supposed to be the hair and the rectangle is supposed to be the face. And then the squiggly thing that you see on the side began as words for feet. Mm. So Dao is literally a person on the path. Now, if you think about the path, there's your personal path, which means you're always moving, you're always on a journey. But so too is the entire world. The entire world has a path, a way to move, and it also is in constant movement. So now the question is, can we meld our personal path to the universal path? And so a lot of times, and we're in a perfect example now, we have a coronavirus pandemic. The whole world has had to respond. We may want to go one way, but the universe is going to go another. Hmm. So what makes sense? To make, it makes sense that we follow that movement instead of trying to oppose it. When we try to oppose circumstance, fate, and the way nature works, we will suffer. You still will struggle if you happen to work with nature, but it's a much easier life. Yes? Philosophically, that means we should pattern our outlook not on something that is defined by human beings, but by something that's natural. Again, can we align our personal philosophy with the natural truths that are all around us?